Hello fellow vapors, how you doing? It's been a little while since I've done a review so I thought I'd better get back on, throw you a few more little juices to have a go at. Um, I've got some really interesting ones here today. I'll just do one of them but I'll, uh, I'll talk you through the lineup. And they come from tribucovapors.com. I'll stick the link in the description as usual. Um, all tobacco vapes and they're supposed to be fine pipe tobacco. Um, I'll give you a little look at the bottles that we've got. Got a few. That's two 30ml bottles. As you can see I've been chugging through them a little bit. Um, they also sent me their other two. Just little taster pots. You can see they've got no drippers in them, no pipettes. So I've emptied this one into another bottle and we'll, we'll have a little drip and talk through it. So they do four flavours all together. Um, really interesting guys, I've got to say, go and have a look at the website. Um, it's kind of a mill work, so they do some woodwork stuff as well, some pipe holders and stuff. Um, so they've definitely come from a you know, tobacco background, which is good. You know, if you're looking for your tobacco vapes, these guys are obviously really quite passionate about their tobacco. Um, and the way that they formulate their juices is very interesting. Not heard of anything like it before from anywhere else. Um, they naturally hand extract all the flavouring for their tobacco juices from tobacco, untreated tobacco leaves, mixed with 100% VG base. So, sounds interesting. I heard about them on a forum, just having a chat with some guys, saying that, you know, getting into my tobacco flavours, really want to have a look at some interesting ones, anyone throw in some decent ideas. Only one guy came up with these and said, have a pop, see what you think. Once you try them, you won't go anywhere else. So it's a bold statement, we'll have a look. Um, so the one we're going to look at today is called Portola. As I said, I've emptied it into a, another bottle here, just so I can drip it without fiddling around too much. Generally speaking, I don't like it when companies send you bottles with no drippers in them. It really quite frustrates me, to be honest. Um, however, certainly with these, these little sample pots, I've got no problem with that at all. Let you off completely. Um, on the website, these guys look really good. Little cork tops on them. These ones didn't come with cork tops, so I've got to be honest, guys, and say either send me a nice cork topped bottle that looks quite sweet or give me a dripper. Don't give me a cap and no dripper. One or the other, please. But anyway, we'll leave it there. Um, right, so we're going to look at Portola. Um, I've just written down a little description of it. So it's a Burley and Virginia tobacco blend um, with a vanilla finish. So I'll show you what we're going to be vaping on. Got the Hannah again today. Um, we've got the Tobe RDA and we'll be running at 30 watts. Might go up and down a bit to test the flavour difference, but we'll see. So let's have a little vape, see how we get on with it. Ooh. I mean, that's, that's some decent production right there. Spot on. I'll tell you what, flavour wise, that's outstanding. Outstanding. Um, that is legitimate. When you're talking tobacco vapes, I mean, I've had quite a few now. I've gone for some Cavendish ones and a few different bits and bobs. You've got your Virginia's, Power Sauce. Nothing comes anywhere near the legitimate taste you get from that. I mean, without smoking tobacco, that's as close as you're going to get to a real deal smoke. And it's strong, believe me. I mean, that's kicking. We'll knock it down a bit and just see if the flavour is uh, different when we go down in the watts. We'll go down to 20. It's 
Still fantastic production, decent flavour, really thick vape. Wow. Wow. I'll tell you what, that's outstanding, it really is. Um, I've been vaping for over a year now, I was a heavy, heavy smoker. Didn't really stick with any tobacco flavours to begin with, or sort of more fruity. Um, I'll tell you what, this stuff is awesome. Um, six milligrams, so we're not talking high nicotine at all, but you get you get a throat hit from it. I'd say low to medium, um, but I'll tell you what, it's the flavour and the density of that vape. <coughs> Outstanding. The real deal is all I can say. Um, I've had two flavours. I've still got another two to test, and I'll, I'll probably do some reviews on the other ones. Um, but trying to trying to pick the vanilla out in that flavour is hard. I, I don't really get a note of vanilla. Um, it's so powerful on the the tobacco edge. In fact, a guy got this for me. He ordered it on my behalf. He got he got a few as well. And he was chatting with the guys, they sound really cool, you know, down to earth kind of guys. And they said that a few people had emailed back in saying, you know, that's pretty strong, you know, your flavour's a bit overpowering maybe, tone it down. And, you know, it sounds like they laughed it off and said, you know, if you want to vape our juice, you need to grow a pair, <laughs> basically. Um, they're my kind of guys, I like it. Um, so, don't expect this to be, you know, a little sort of in between -y flavour, oh, I'll have a little touch of tobacco. You know, this stuff is going to rock you, I'm sure it will. If you're into your tobacco vapes and you've not had any of this, you're missing a trick, I'm telling you. Let's have another little vape. So, like I said, four flavours. This one's Portola. They've got Silverado, Capistrano, and Black Star. So limited range, but I can see why. You know, these guys are naturally hand extracting tobacco flavouring from untreated leaves. You know, you're not going to have 50, 60 different flavours. You know, there's four or five guys on the website, I think, from what I can see. Um, so fairly small setup, but absolutely top quality juice. These guys know what they're doing. Top notch. I'm really, really impressed with it. Crank it back up to 30, shall we? But yeah, you know, I'm vaping this on the Hannah. I've, I've had a little go on the dripper, and I mean, they really do kick on the dripper. The, the production's phenomenal, which you'd expect 100% VG baseline on the juice with the natural extraction for the flavouring, so it's going to cloud. So, a little something different for you. If you want to try a full-on legitimate tobacco vape, hit Tribuco up, tribucovapor.com. Have a look, see what you think. You know, they've only got four flavours, so you may as well order four, if you know what I'm saying. Um, have a vape, see what you think. I rate them highly. Well done, guys, if you're watching this. You know, big up to you. That is outstanding. It's not a normal vape for me. It really sets aside the rest of the tobacco vapes that I've had. Spot on, really like it. So enjoy, hope you get something out of this. Go and buy yourself a couple of bottles if you like the sound of it. Comment, let me know what you think. Peace out, good to see you all. Vape on, drop them cigarettes.